Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com with Jason. Happy 10th anniversary to us. We've got a huge promo going on. Check it out. Thanks everyone for your support over the last decade. This is double header number three, 24 hobby boxes, all card ship. Jason's got it started right here. Big thanks to everybody here uh, for getting in on the action. You can see the top camera right there. Peace. And off to the side on my face camera, you'll see what's going on. Big thanks everybody to getting for uh, getting into double header, pick your team three. Kick back and relax, ladies and gentlemen. Edgar needs a needs a Yamamoto. Or is that that's under the name Ramon? But, but Edgar's rooting for Ramon. Get a Yamamoto, that'd be nice. I wouldn't mind that. Yeah, there's an insane amount of people breaking this stuff today. I mean, yeah, they make 15 so much cases. Of it. Jeez. But who cares what they're doing? You know what we're doing? We're giving away a case of Bowman baseball hobby. Yeah. Yeah. And these sweet hats. Sweet hats? Here's what the other guys are doing. What are we doing? Jaspiescasebreaks.com. I didn't even know other people existed. Bro. I know, seriously. I thought we were the only ones that did this. Hobby, what, one auto? One auto per box. One yeah. auto per box. That, I mean, that's the crazy thing is that we've seen that happen before. A person that just buys one team in one of these Bowman breaks and ends up being the winner of the grand prize. There are other prizes too. The full list, prize list is on the website, jaspiescasebreaks.com, but yeah, all it takes is one. One and a little bit of hobby luck, that is it. I have to get used to this new list of players to talk to, uh, I know. Just sleep and talk. Dude, I had it on the side and I was like, you know, I'm going to stick it to this wall. No, this is a good idea. It's like right the, I got the list right in front of my face. We've got Aiden Miller for the Phillies. We've got Arjun and Namala, the Indian American kid for uh, Toronto. Is he the first Indian American in the first round, I think, or something wow. something like that? Parents are from India. I think they came over to the States ages ago. And then I think he went to... High school in Florida or something like that? It's an East Coast guy, I think. Uh, Brock Wilkin for the Brewers. Dylan Cruz, obviously, for the Nationals. Ellie Dela Cruz, rookie cards for the Reds. Greg Lombard Jr. for the Yankees. Um, Kyle Teal for the Red Sox. Do we have Teal parallels in this? Teal Teal would be pretty cool. Uh, Luis Baez for the Astros. What was there before? <laughs> oh, you know what's so funny? No one caught it. I was the first one to catch it. My living catch and nobody here. Uh, Vanessa turned this out that she added the teams. Uh huh. It said Houston Rockies. Houston. <laughs> and I was like, hey, it says Houston Rockies. And she's like, oh, she got on the rest. <laughs> and then Michael's like, if it makes you feel any better, I didn't even catch it. <laughs> yeah, no, I didn't catch it either. She, <laughs> did, she distributed like, those lists yeah, like. Yesterday. Yeah, yesterday. Yeah. I was like, well, I mean, I've seen uh, it right away. So. Luis Baez for the Astros, Walker Jenkins for the Twins, Yamamoto rookie cards for the Dodgers, and Yoendri Morales also for the Nationals. Those are our key, uh, what we determine are the key rookies that we'll be sleeving and top loading. But yeah, there are other guys too. Sal Freelix in there, all card ships, so you'll be getting everything, everybody. Yeah, the uh, Brewers have a good crop of youngsters uh, that they have on that team, so it's got to be exciting for Brewers fans. Yelich just, just, Yelich just came back from the IL. Uh, Bryce Turing, I think, has been really playing well. I think he's been stealing bases like 
think it's Bryce Turing who's been stealing bases like nobody else's business. And then I've got Garrett Mitchell, who was on his way to being a starting outfielder before he broke his wrist at the end of spring training. I haven't stashed away yeah, on my... so injured, like last year too, started off your age. Garrett Mitchell? Yeah. Sliding injury, surgery, hopefully a year. And yeah. And I was curious about him, and I was like, he's injured already! Yeah. I was like, man. I'm, t I'm talking up the Brewers. I'm talking up the Brewers. All right, here we go. Paul Skeens just got called up today. Ellie De La Cruz rookie card. So I'll try to remember and catch as much of these as possible. Oh, right. Oh, I, I get you. Yeah, they suck. Don't buy yeah, them. Yeah, they're terrible. There's Yoandre Morales. Braden Taylor Orange. 10 out of 25 paper for Tampa Bay. Jonathan with the Rays. It's mainly all the bigger players. I don't know the exact full checklist, but we've pulled a couple of Tani's already. Carol. Mookie. There's Arjun Namala, who's got all of those will go to Tim and the Blue Jays. Prospect power up Wyatt Langford. I like that pinball machine design there. And it's Braden Taylor. Oh, these are not numbered, these lunars. But they look pretty cool. Yoandri Vargas. You want your Morales paper for Washington. I gotta get used to who these key rookies are gonna be. Samuel Zavala, mini diamonds, which are not numbered, but we'll go to San Diego, that looks pretty cool. Luis Baez is one of them, right? Yeah, Luis Baez, all of those will go to Mark and the Strohs. And listen, I'm sure I'm gonna miss some, but if I do, um, our shipping team, sorting and shipping team will catch them as well when they're working on all that. We'll try to catch the majority of them. We've got that grass parallel, 68 out of 99, Carlos Silva. That'll be for the twins. That's going to go to Mark. Prospect power up. Jackson Churio, Rising Infernos. We got Aiden Miller. All of these Aiden Millers will go to Rich. Jared Jones, strikeout machine right there. And our first, or our, our auto for the box is Carson Rucker. I'll do an autograph and other key card recap uh, at, the, uh, at the end of this double header. Tigers, that's going to go to Joe. Bowman first. Joe Downing with Detroit. All right, box one, done. 
Spears hobby box. I'm going to start grabbing. Yeah, one break, two break. So here's another box. Half boxes right here. Another half box here. Half box. Half box. Half box. Half box. Half box. Half box. Nice. So we got a lot on our table here. Start working through these right here. Yeah, only 23 more. Good luck, everybody. Baez, not Luis Montos. There's another Arjun. The mini diamonds, not numbered. All card ship. There's a Yoshinobu Yamamoto. Douglas Glad, Lunar. Cruz. What are these called? These are cool though. Aiden Miller paper. Yeah, man. We're only top loading and sleeving up uh, Aiden Miller for the Phillies. Uh, Arjun Nimala for the Blue Jays. Brock Wilkin for the Brewers. Dylan Cruz for the Nationals. Ellie Del Cruz for the Reds. Greg Lombard Jr. for the Yankees. Kyle Steele for the Red Sox. Luis Baez for the Astros. Walker Jenkins for the Twins, Yamamoto for the Dodgers, and Johanny Morales for the Nationals. Jordan Adams to 499. It's only two rookies, actually. Everybody else is prospects. Unfortunately, we can't sleep and top load everybody, so kind of have to make that hard decision. Some people may say, oh, you should be adding this guy or not, which sometimes yeah. we do. Ooh, I mean, but look at these. A little, so remember those? Those are very common before. In Bowman last year. Oh yeah, these were the spotlight uh, ones. So now that, they yeah. take them one every two cases. I wow, guess, so that's good. Because that's actually a really cool card. Forty nine out of one fifty. That's Evan Carter for the Rangers. So, uh, rare numbered insert right here. That's going to go to Mark Bissett and the Rangers. There you go, Mark. But yeah, if we ever do that, anybody, we we'll let you guys know. But it's usually those main guys. You still get everything. I mean, obviously you're going to get all the numbered cards and autographs, top loaders. It's not like. Nothing. It's funny because as the, uh, you know, like the within like a few months that this list gets smaller and smaller. Yeah, maybe yeah, exactly. It gets smaller and then some other dude out of nowhere. Gets yeah, smaller. exactly. Yeah, and then someone. Then he's the chase. Com now. Yeah, completely random different people get added to the list. So that's why Bowman's fun. And there's Bryce Matthews, Gold Auto, 32 out of 50. Good penmanship there. That's for Mark R. Rutowski and the Houston Astros. Late first round pick. Another Aiden Miller. Let's not move I feel like I'm not seeing any of the other guys. <laughs> you know, it took me a while when I did my doublehead earlier. It was like the last people I didn't see was Teal and Morales. Okay, but so it took me a while. Like, and so it just they're like just, we're, they're we're, just they're hiding. Yeah, it's like we're focusing on some of them so far. But you, you'll you'll find them toward the end of the break, like all of them. All right. But they're not all as common as those. I was like, and then and then Mike was like, dude, I didn't even look for Teal. <laughs> it's just like I didn't even see it. I was like, yeah. It's a big list this year. All right. Well, Kyle Teal, I guess maybe short printed EA, so we'll, we'll try to we'll try to conjure one up for you. There's a Luis Baez. 
And like I said, our shipping team has the same list, so yeah. if we miss anything, our sorting team, they're really good, they'll find it. There's Braden Taylor yeah, it's to anyway, four ninety nine. They sort out by team, they just gotta look. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. I think you Andrew Morales is on the list, yeah. Yes. Yeah. That's the last one I could really find much until I started noticing him. Alright, let's start another box. Yeah, Aiden Miller for now has, has all the. He's the one showing up the most here. There's an Arjun Namala paper. And Walker Jenkins, the auto nice. popping early in this box. He's one. on our list, right? Yeah, for the Twins. There you go. This is the guy you're looking for. Mark Bissett, Minnesota Twins, 34 out of 150. A blue lunar. You can see the, the lunar pattern in the background. That's really cool. The fifth overall pick in last year's draft. Nice. Ranked 16 best prospect overall by Baseball America. Wow. Yeah, that's pretty high, huh? Usually they're like number 16 prospect in the Twins organization, but no. Overall. Overall, that's really good. So the auto popping early in this box. So let's see if we can find some good parallels here. Some of the key players we're looking for. If you start seeing that it's first in every right stack, then maybe we'll go to the left. Right, yeah, maybe I might <laughs> have to like switch sides, yeah. Way. Ooh, I think we see a nice magenta coming up. Can you see it, ladies and gentlemen? Can you tell who the player is? One of our key rookies here, key prospects. It's Brock Wilkin, 72 out of 199. Matt with his brew crew. Love seeing numbered cards of the key rookies that we're looking for. 18th overall pick. Eighth prospect and eighth best prospect in that organization. That's a good farm system too. Oh, George Lombard Jr. is one of the guys we're looking for as well. Yankees, all of those will go to Mark Bissett. Oh, and there's an insert of him right there as well. Maybe we'll find a numbered card of his. That'd be cool. Ellie Dela Cruz. Aiden Smith to 150, and a Dylan Cruz. I feel like that's our first Dylan Cruz. Kristen in the Nationals. Yamamoto and Ellie Dela Cruz are the only two rookie cards that were that are going to be on the top load list. Reds is Tony, and Ramon has my Dodgers, and Aiden Smith will go to Seattle. That's for Chris Parent. I'm up to the challenge, Matt. Or or uh, they already played. They oh. beat, beat the Marlins. So early game. Oh, it was an early game. Today. It was 12 o'clock. Here? Yeah. Wow. Super early. Damn. I've been watching. I don't even know. What was the score? Did beat them down? Uh, yeah, 4-3-1 or something like that. It was kind of close, but it was a nice start for uh, Gavin Stone, Ty Oscar out of homer. I see the homer now. Yeah. Especially at home. You might have 10 now. I think so. There's Celestine Mini Diamonds. What's that? I kind of want to bring him back, but it's just... Yeah, it's, it's kind of a crowded... Yeah. I mean, if he plays well this season, yeah, he's he's going to he's gonna price himself out of the Dodgers. There's Aiden Smith, purple uh, Ray Wave to 250. Maybe he does a shot. <laughs> yeah, it's just different. People, <laughs> people, would be, him, people would be so pissed. <laughs> it's like, it's not our fault they're accepting deferments, deferrals. Yeah. No, Bob has actually, since he got called, he's doing great. Yeah. He's... Uh, he was on the radar, for at least for Dodger fans anyway. He was definitely on the radar. Um, 
like a, here's here's some paper for you, Matt, for Brock. But then this was a year, not even last year. This was two years ago. He was on the radar. Then he destroyed his shoulder. He blew out his shoulder somehow. But then came back kind of in record time. Didn't miss as much time. And then everyone just thought, oh, he was gonna he's gonna be. It's gonna take him a while for him to get his shoulder back. You know, and but he started crushing in spring training, and then kept crushing in the uh, minors, and they were they were forced to call him up. Yeah, and now, someone's gonna be odd man out. Yeah. Chris Taylor maybe. Yeah. There's Anthony Shul, so it is on the all on the right side. So I might start on the left side yeah, first. Left. So Anthony Shul, 157 at 250, purple auto for the Halos. That's gonna be for John. Number 30 prospect, Angels prospect. But yeah, Chris Taylor might be, and then Jason Hayward's coming back too. Yeah. It's Gladiators of the Diamond, Justin Crawford, so someone's gonna lose playing time. There's Arjun. I mean, James Altman might lose time. He's, I mean, he's been struggling. Yeah. There's right, Ellie Dela Cruz. Good, man. I mean, I took a lunch break, but not really. I mean, I, I couldn't eat a sandwich. But it was my sister's birthday, so I wanted to go surprise her at work. Oh, nice. Yeah, she's, she's back there working over here at this level, so... Wait, where's she? Oh, at the athletic. You told me yeah, that. Yeah, she was in Long Beach, but then she got a bigger manager spot over here. So she Antonio Anderson, there. thirty-two out of one hundred and fifty. And uh, the point. EA. So I have to quickly go. Right she the one that was working at the Gap. Is that yeah, that sister? Okay. Yeah, she's there right now. It's the same family, isn't it? Gap. And yeah. Athleta. Yeah. Yeah. Athletics. They're Lululemon, basically. Right. Yeah, I went to an athletic once with my sister. I was like, this. This is expensive. Yeah, it's very expensive. Like, this is pretty high end. Yeah. I mean, thankfully she gets a good deal. She gets like 50% off, so Ooh. it definitely helps. Yeah, then that's what we're wanting. Like, I want four pairs of these and my brother, like $150 each. Are they, uh, are there guy stuff? No, there's no guy stuff. Athletics just women. Yeah. Got it. At least for now. The Lululemon used to be Lululemon just women, right? Yeah, and then they, they started doing guys, like joggers and stuff like that? Yeah, their leggings are like $150. But it's Damn. Like, Good, good material to the point where like they last forever. And how like sand, you they, can throw it like in a dirty clothes they, laundry, they, they say, and like it has the technology where like you're not gonna smell nothing. Better last forever. Yeah, I'm saying that much. Yeah, yeah, mine got here at six, I got here at nine, so. Right, and then I, I tagged I just in. didn't think it was gonna sell out, so I told him like, I'm gonna sneak out right now for like 30, 40 minutes, and Hopefully that double header didn't sell out. Or Tim juggle. with the Blue Jays gets the yellow paper. Yeah, I was I was driving in, and then I was just like, I might not have anything to break by the time I go in there. <laughs> yeah, no. There's Colin Hawk, 103 out of 125 for the Mets. Yeah, if it had sold out, I, I wasn't going to go, but then I was like, uh, I have like 15, 20 minutes, maybe I can hold off and go really quick. Dylan Cruz paper. Yeah, Michael definitely. Ooh, a Kyle Teal. There he is, yeah. Found one. I'm sure Michael right now is in hibernating mode right now. Yeah. yeah. And he's going to get up way too early tomorrow, and he's going to be like, shoot, what am I doing? <laughs> Sleep schedule's going to be all messed I thought, up. I you're going to come to three tomorrow, dude. Sheesh. I, know. I was like, yeah, the rest of this day and all day tomorrow. Yeah. Matt Shaw, mini diamonds. Oh, nice. Jordan, uh, Jordan Westberg's having a great year. I'm going to slide a bunch of boxes on the table, and then Jason will get started on the next case. Luis Baez. Yeah, if you see those in the corners, and I'll take those and see them off. I got it. Can we raise the table just a little bit? Yeah, yeah, of course. Let's give it a, yeah, uh, a little right. more, a little more, a little more. Little more. Yeah, that's probably pretty good. All right, um, this was an early box. Let me slide this up front. And let me grab 
grab half boxes here. All goosey. What's going on, Eric Hughes? Huh? The surface, uh, it's always hard to tell surface for me, but I think they look pretty clean this year. Honestly, I feel like you still need to clean them. I mean, yeah. if, if you're going to grade them. At this point, at this time of day, uh, this, this era, basically, everybody needs to clean stuff nowadays. I guess, yeah, that's probably a good rule of thumb. Straight. I mean, we're not really, like, eating with, like, Cheetos in our hands. But, <laughs> right, right, right. But still, like, there's going to be just something the, Just there. the manufacturing process and just the way it is. You kind of see that box hiding in the corner right there. I'll just leave those here for now. All right. So this, this is basically what you see on the table right here and what you see on that top camera right over here. That's it. That's the first case. And then we'll start working on the next case. All right. I'm going to start with the left stack because I think all the autos are on the right half of each box. All right. And away we go. Good luck, everybody. We got Mike Bove, Boeve, Bo Bove. How are we saying this? Ninety-one out of two hundred and fifty. Purple Railway for Matt and the Brew Crew. Oh, I see. I see what Eric did. Yeah, uh, ladies and gentlemen, just as a quick check, every once in a while, you should just. Make sure you're watching live, the live point of the uh, stream. Where are they calling up Junior Caminero? Yeah, make sure the live point of the stream, every once in a while, um, YouTube will, will make you lag. Will, slow down your stream for whatever reason and then you'll be like minutes behind if not if not more oh, the, now the auto's on the left side that's Kelvin Hidalgo <laughs> maybe it's the way he drafted it like, maybe you know, yeah <laughs> maybe it is maybe I switched it I don't know <laughs> damn now I don't know where they're at in coup with the Rockies. You see a chrome in the first like three parts after the yeah, like I'm stop. Just, <laughs> you know. Just in a just in a groove and I'm just like, shoot, there it is. Another Kyle Teal. There's a Yamamoto. There's a Dylan Cruz paper. Have you seen any Dylan Cruz autos? Right no, now? we haven't no. had one yet. We are due. Interesting. We are so due. All right. Three double headers and nothing. Got to try to conjure that for, for Tristan. Yeah, three jumbos, nothing yet? What's going on here? He's definitely a unicorn. It's Arjun, Chrome. Michael needs a lullaby to fall asleep. Go well, you know, sleep. we can't get caught. You know, go uh, <laughs> Not Like Us is not copyrighted right now by Kendrick, so you can go to sleep with that. All right, go sleep with that. Go to sleep, go to sleep, go to sleep, Michael Jaspi. Just wait, just put it on really loud right now when mm -hmm. I do the pack review. Just white oh, noise. yeah. White noise. That is, that is good white noise. It's just a, such, a, such a rhythmic... Pattern. Doesn't exist, Matt, if we didn't see it here. Yeah, if we didn't see it, it's not real. <laughs> There's Arjun in that insert. That looks really cool. Oh, and an Aiden Miller Chrome for the Phillies. That's for Rich.
JD Gonzalez, Paper, Kyle Teal, Chrome. JD Gonzalez will go to Marcy and the Padres. And Carson Rucker, also on the left side. Hmm. Detroit, that'll be for Joe Downing. Purple movie? paper. What was that Twister movie? Remember the Twister one? You know, right. They're coming out with a sequel, I guess. Twisters. Twisters, right? Yeah. 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 How is it that it's coming out in like a month or two, and there's all these crazy twisters Whoa. coming out right now? Like you overall? think they planned it? I, I mean, <laughs> it's kind of weird though. Like the like an insane amount, like never before, like. I guess you just kind of go, well, when's tornado season? Let's release <laughs> yeah, the movie then. But damn, bro, they're getting abnormal amounts, dude. They're getting a lot of them. Yo, Andrea Morales. Wow. The MVP voting was kind of close, kind of. Oh, did they Jokic announce that already? Jokic got it, though. Jokic got it? Total points. Who was second, though? Oh, uh, SGA was. Ah. Well, I guess, nah, I guess not that close, actually. No, I forget it. Okay. First place was, at least it wasn't. There's an Aid Miller Rising Inferno's insert. Damn, Jokic is on some elite level, huh? Dylan Cruz. That could have been almost four straight out Gee, I know, right? There's Filippo de Turi to 399. Lava. Going to Matt and the Brew Crew. Well, he's moving up. Last year he was number five in the list. Now he's number two. And if he knocks out if he knocks out some more chips. So I'm just adjusting some settings really quick. Cars looks a little too washed out there. Yeah, the lava to three ninety nine. I think the cards don't look as washed out now. It's a tiny bit darker, but there's a Brock Wilkin Chrome. Drake mini diamonds, these are not numbered. Chase Davis. Tiny bit brighter. All right, I'm gonna grab the 12th and final box here. Jason's gonna get started on the other case. Thanks everybody, good luck. You injured Morales. Wyatt Langford, Mini Diamonds. Kyle Teal Chrome for the Red Sox.
Andrew Morales Chrome, Ellie Dela Cruz Paper, Junior Cameron Arrow, 299, 64 out of 299, nice one. For the Rays, that'll be for Jonathan. Aiden Miller for the Phillies. I'm a big hitting prospect for the uh, for the Rays. Only a matter of time before he gets called up. Yamamoto. Rising Infernos, Jordan Lawler. Nice. Got a Homer Bush uh, Speckle. Those are numbered. That's to two ninety nine. In the bottom right hand corner. That's for Marcy and the Padres. And the auto, Ryan Lasco. Oakland A's autograph going to uh, going to Brian Brian H. Nice getting their forty first overall pick, so mid mid second round, mid to early second round. There's a Chrome Dylan Cruz, Cam Collier. We got a Yankee Lombard Jr. That'll be for Mark. that box that's hiding way over there. Just so get it back on camera. Plate autograph, an on plate auto. Love that. Thanks, Brian. Brian was just saying a big hit lurking. Not a super fractor, but still a one of one. Esmil Valencia, Houston Astros. That's going to be for Mark R. And all aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. This is rare. Just getting no love. Yeah, plates get no love. I love the printing plates. I usually don't really, are not bothered by like sticker autos. I don't mind them too much. I do mind if it's on a plate. That just looks weird. But very nice. Another Lombard Jr. Like, bro, just sign on the play, bro. 
Yeah, I have seen stickers on plates before. There's a Lombard Junior paper. It just looks, doesn't look good. And we've got some Lunar here to 125, 50 out of 125, Jacob Wilson. That's for the A's. That'll be for Brian H. Got a paper Dylan Cruz. Got a Kyle Teal for the Red Sox paper. There's a Brock Wilkin Chrome for the Brew Crew. Gavin Williams, green paper to $3.99. That is for Cleveland. This is for you. That's uh, Brian Cochran with that one, Brian C. Luis Baez for the Astros. Luis De La Cruz rookie. Mini Diamonds, Carlos Silva. Brock Wilkins paper. Yoshinobu Yamamoto. Oh, so Valencia was the guy that the printing plate we just pulled. So Tao does the 29th best Astro farmhand MLB pipeline. So hopefully ends up being ends up being real good. All right, another box coming up. All right, good luck. Luis Baez, purple paper with some sort of paisley background. Yeah, we're calling it a bandana. Yeah, or some right? sort of bandana background. Like bandana. Yeah, that's the pattern. 88 out of 199. Purple paper. It's a key rookie. We like these. It's going to be for Mark and the Astros. Mark R. We have an official name for this. Uh, I guess just purple pattern to 199. Boring. I know. Oh, maybe right there. I'm trying to look on this list. No, that's that's a different no. one. That these are refractors. Yeah. No. Black. Purple pattern. Well, Come on, yeah. Purple bandana to 199. Jason, do do you, what do you know about the bandana world? Not much. Not much. Just I don't. Normal colors I've ever seen. I don't. I don't. It's the same pattern I've always seen. Now, apparently, I, I don't know much about the bandana world, but certain colored bandanas out of your back pocket may mean oh, certain, for may sure. mean certain yeah, things. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know, like, oh, that part, yeah. if you have a certain colored bandana of your back pocket, maybe you're a swinger with, you know, <laughs> something like that. You know, maybe you're looking for, you know, maybe you're into some sort of fetish or something. I don't know. It's a world that I don't know. You know, and obviously, you know, Gang affiliations too, depending on what kind of bandanas hanging out of your back pocket. So that's why I just avoid any bandana. <laughs> I don't want to accidentally. Yeah, you're like what? I it's like what? What? I didn't even know it was. It's not what I was this was just to. yeah. This was just to keep 
dust out of my face and sweat out of my eyes. Right. So this is just yeah. my outfit. Bro. Yeah, it's just messy. Yeah, <laughs> I wasn't trying to make a statement. The Kyle Teal paper. Brock Wilkin Chrome. Christian Yelich just made his way back off the aisle recently, maybe even today. And the, there's the auto. It's Antonio Anderson, Boston Red Sox, EA Sports. It's in the game. You go number 14, Red Sox farmhand. Always good to see. Della Cruz can do it all. Lombard Jr., Yankees. Lombard Jr., Paper. Luis Baez paper. Ellie Dela Cruz rookie card. I feel like he's doing well this season, right? Ellie Dela Cruz, Robert Colas. Double one out. Pretty bad at the end of the last yeah, game. that's that's why pe that people got worried. I think. <laughs> yeah, dude, he was pretty bad at one point. Well, yeah, that's what I was saying. Like this product's coming out with his rookie year In now. In cool with the Rockies. It's perfect because it starts to right. get great. Even better. Brock Wilkin, Paper. Yeah, Most players are going to go through some sort of rookie slump. Yeah. It's going to happen. I just didn't want to be like that harsh to Zucchino. Like he, oh, oh, I know, right? I think, I think, like, oh, he's be the main guy well, I think since year. he's on the same team, I think yeah. people got like PTSD and they're like, oh. Like, uh, like if this guy does the same thing next year, it's like damn. But for those of you who are who held on and did not sell Ali De La Cruz too early, I think you're gonna be gonna be happy again. There's a Felix Morabell to three ninety nine. Moro Bell for the Halos. That's gonna be for John. We got a Jerron Elkins shimmer to 125. Nice steel shimmer. That looks really cool. That's going to go to Ramon and the Dodgers. And we've got a Douglas Glott to 299. That's for Eric Jennings and the Braves. More Ali De La Cruz. Brock Wilkin paper. Spencer Jones, Yoshinobu. Uh, nice, mini diamond, George Lombard Jr. It's one of our key guys, key players that we're looking for here. That's Mark Bissett and the Yankees. You know, that looks too dark. Once I catch it in this light, right move this in a little bit. 
There you go. I like that mini diamonds pattern. Dylan Cruz paper. Kyle Teal paper. Second half of the box. Prospect power up, Walker Jenkins. And Barrett Kent, Angels. It's going to be for John. Ninth in the organization. Uh, no, 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 nothing Brewers wise, Matt. But look at this. The anime card, nice. It's uh, Marcelo Meyer. Shortstop for the Red Sox. EA with that one. It's in the game. These are uh, one per case, right? Nice, that's really cool. Prospect power up, Lombard Jr. And we've got a Ray Wave to 150, 104 out of 150, Johan Fran Garcia. EA with the Red Sox. Luis Baez paper. And Chase Young, Josh's brother on the back there. All right, two more boxes in uh, the first case, and then Jason has the other case ripped right here. I'll put all those on this main camera here in a second once I'm done with these two. Yeah, Matt, so those two are the last two boxes of the first case, and the half case is right here. And then once I clear the table, Jason will work on ripping the second half. So we're, uh, we're almost done with the first case. We are about 54 minutes in, so I think we are pretty much on track. There's an Aiden Miller paper. It's for the Phillies, for Rich. Sebastian Walcott. Your Andrew Morales for Tristan and the Nats. There's a Walter Jenkins. I think he's on the list. Yeah, Twins. That's going to be for Mark Bissett. Uh, Alfredo Duno to $4.99 for the Reds. Reds Diamondback. Diamondbacks at Reds tied it tied it to a piece. 
Oh, we got a whole other case to go, Matt. Don't count yourself out just yet. Don't be down on yourself just yet. There's Arjun. Arjun will go to the Blue Jays. That's going to be for Tim and Toronto. Future, future teammates, future stars. Walter Jenkins, 139 out of 150. Blue Shimmer for the Twins. Mark Bissett. Ellie Dela Cruz, who took a walk, it looks like, or did he? Did take a walk and steals a base. Kyle Teal, Chrome. Prospect Power Up, Wyatt Langford. Cam Collier. And there's the auto. Aiden Smith, 275 out of 499, Seattle. That's going to be for Chris Parent. Wow, Ellie just stole third. FS1. It's a national game, ladies and gentlemen. All right, so there you go, Seattle. Chris Parent. Last box, first case coming up. Luis Baez. Tommy Troy to three ninety nine. Uh, 245 out of 399. That's for uh, Ancoa and the Snakes. Ali yeah, okay. Dela Cruz. No one's no one's gonna see it. Just us. I was the only one that noticed about it. <laughs> I'll, I'll change it afterwards. <laughs> I could see I could see where her head was going though. It's like she's kind of in basketball mode. Right. But then it's like, oh wait, it's art, art, baseball, 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 Rockies. Okay, done. <laughs> and then you're like, oh, whoops. Yeah, Ellie does have wheels. I mean, he could he could steal home if it wasn't two outs. There's Ellie again. Aiden Miller, paper. Yamamoto. Uh, 
And there's Eric Bautista, 128 out of 150. For the Rocks, that's going to go to Inku. He's a surprisingly, you know, Matt, I feel like Ellie is also a surprisingly good defender at, at shortstop. Walter Jenkins for the Twins. You know, like usually those tall shortstops. Wow, but but yeah, you can fly. Andrew, what's going on? Who gets the our our uh, our amazing sorting and shipping team will have the pleasure of of sorting this out. They're the real MVPs. There's Arjun Nimala for Toronto. I want to see some color or ink of him too. That a Dylan Cruz insert was pretty cool. Last little stack, and I'll start putting the first part of the second case onto my table here. Got a Dylan Cruz rising infernos. Part of that great LSU team with Skeens. There's Samuel Zavala and a Yoendri Vargas, 22 out of 25. Orange. Ramon with the Dodgers. Nice 13th best talent in the Dodgers system. And obviously the Dodgers have a really good farm system, so that's that's high praise, I think. There's Aiden Miller, nice. Some aqua shimmer. I like seeing color from our top for our top tier guys. Phillies, rich black with the fills black is going to get a teal shimmer 53 out of 125 numbering kind of hard to see right there but there it is nice first round pick for the fills for the fighting fills all right cole young is the last card of the first case all right Half a box. Other half. No, it's outdoors. Huh. It looks dark. Oh, I guess it is kind of dark already by now, right? It's 8 o'clock. Oh, I guess yeah, it is true. 8. <laughs> I was just like, I, I, I kind of was like, yeah, it does look kind of dark out there, doesn't it? All right, so we got one, two, three, four, five. We got half a case right out there. Jason's going to work on the other half. All right. Uh, next case. This is the case two. About an hour five in, yeah, it's gonna probably be a solid two hour break. Thanks everybody. I don't know if we're gonna see any more double headers today, but we got plenty of jumbos to work on. A lot of those jumbo case breaks were pretty close. I feel like, could we run that promo tonight? Let's, uh, let's see how close we can get. What's that? Oh, I'm saying, like, let's see how close we can get it. Yeah. I feel like we can get it pretty close. Yeah, if we run out of time with the break sells out, then yeah. We can just do the break tomorrow. Yeah, I I would be down to do that. Yeah, if, if I'm here until around 11 o'clock Pacific, 
if the if the very last spot sells out, I'll see how I feel. Maybe I'll even do it. I don't know. Maybe. But if there's a jum jumbo's aren't that bad. No, I think I think they're like much of they're like forty five to an hour, I think. Yeah, you know what? If the last jumbo if it's a, if it comes down to the last jumbo and it sells out, I'll do the I'll do the break and the promo. How about that? How about that? Let's make it a night. There's Walter Jenkins. Homer Bush Jr. Green Paper goes to uh, Marcy and the Padres. The Walter Jenkins goes to Mark and the Twins. Is that number? No, that's just the team color. There's Arjun for Toronto. That's for Tim. There's an Arjun insert right there. McDonald's? I do, right? actually. Yeah. So I heard that their new menu, they expanded. Apple pie McFlurry. What? Or like they blend in an apple pie in there. See. You don't, you don't think that'd be great? I'm not a combo guy. Uh, I'm not I'm not a Rex. It sounds interesting. Though. Rex was talking about how how a Sour Patch Kids are gonna be there's gonna be Oreo Sour Patch oh, no, no, Kids. No, no, no. And I was I like I was like, I don't need that. Well yeah, no, I wouldn't do like sour and sweet. Wait, so they're gonna take a McFlurry and blend in a I fresh guess. apple pie in yeah, there? Yeah, I guess. That's I mean that's something interesting. I wouldn't it's do sour interesting. Patch. I wouldn't do sour patch and actually. Here's uh Spencer Jones to uh four ninety nine. That's gonna be for the Yankees, that'll be for Mark Bissett. And they're like basically trying out like surf and turf. So you know what that is? Just a burger, oh. patty, a burger patty and a filet of fish in one sandwich. And a filet of fish? Yeah, one sandwich. I don't that's, know about, that's I don't a little know. Weird, I don't know about that either. <laughs> I'm like, bro, like, the only one that intrigued me was just like that apple pie. Yeah, I mean, I think, that, it's, just, I think it's just vanilla ice cream, and they're just throwing it in with like... All right. You know, if it's that, I think I'll, I'll be able to try that. Because I do like apple pies. Apple pies on a... I feel like that's like a fall a fall food for me. Fall in any yeah, cold yeah. day, get a hot nice apple pie. Mm. Yeah. All right, and the autograph is Anthony Baptiste. 64 out of 100 mini diamond autograph. Yeah, Brian, you know... Um, that's David Johansson and the Mets. I only got to see like the fourth quarter yesterday. But it was a good game, man. I mean, it, it was close. You know, they brought the Dallas brought it down to like one. Closing down around the third, but kind of just run out of gas, it looks like. Looked like Luca was kind of a little limpy, too. And Thunder, they, they just made a lot of shots yesterday. So I was very happy. Yeah, Thunder looked good. Right, next little bit right here. Kyle Teal, Chrome. You see the video of the balcony bouncing at the Fox Theater in Detroit during a Gunna concert? Well, I felt it like that before when I went to, um, what was it, the Wiltern? It was very scary. Being in like the loge up there, it was bouncing. Yeah. I'm like, whoa, this thing's gonna fall. <laughs> like, yeah, it's balconies, gonna fall. balconies bounce, Rex. That's what happened. In fact, you actually want them to bounce. Yeah, I think they're actually designed. It's, it's, yeah, it's, the flexibility is good. Because you need a little wiggle room. Like in a bridge. Everyone thinks a bridge is a, a fixed fixture. No, you actually need to have some give in a bridge. That's a healthy balcony. A balcony that doesn't have bend like that, I mean, that could just be like, snap. Yeah, you never know. Just in a split second. Snap. Yeah. True. Walker Jenkins, Rising Infernos. Uh, Lombard Jr. Paper. James Wood, ooh, piece of candy. 
<laughs> one six one eighteen out of one twenty. Ooh, piece of candy. Yeah. Ooh, James Wood. Ooh, piece of candy. Tristan with the Nats. Yeah, I, I mean, that word, I still think, has the power to come back. I think Atman said it right. Like, hey, man, we made all our shots. They didn't that day. It just seemed like Denver was just, just out of it. Jamal Murray, I thought she got fine. I mean, she got suspended, dude. That's dangerous. Imagine yeah. That, slipped or something. That would have been real bad. They did that for ratings and money. It, probably, no yeah. There's no way We're just going to throw them a hefty $100,000 fine. They're not going to take a star out of that game. That, that, that's going to that's gonna make him learn. $100,000. Yeah, Jamal's also not 100. percent So yeah, I mean, credit to Minnesota, man. They're playing good defense. They contest every shot. But I wouldn't say just yet. If Denver somehow loses, yeah, it's over now. If they would lose Game Three. And there's Ryan Lasco, Oakland A's. Brian, Brian with Ryan. Yeah, right. The same physics applies with uh, with a lot of structures. Did you know that skyscrapers sway up to multiple feet? Either way, you got to design it like that. Bruce Wayne. Wow. In what? our chat. Bruce Wayne. I mean, you're not a busy guy. No, Bruce ain't not busy. Ben Williamson, mini diamonds. Brock Wilkin, paper. Jackson Churio. There's his brother Byron Churio. Byron? Third Churio Byron. now? What? Isn't there Jason wait, and Jackson? There is. Jason and Jackson? I so don't know if he is. Though. Wait, so is this Churio still related I to the know. other Churio? That's, that's what we're asking earlier. I don't know. It just makes sense, dude. <laughs> huh. No, I Jackson and Jason are brothers. Yes, I don't know about I don't know about yeah. Brian. That I, I cannot confirm that. Apologies. It could be. I don't know. Like the Cunhas. I mean, there are three Acuna brothers. <laughs> I'm not sure if I'm going to get too much information on this. Supposedly, yeah, maybe he's not. It makes it. I think they would have put it on the facts back there. They would have said. Well, like, they're. He's from Meredia, Mar Venezuela, and Jackson Churio's from Maracaibo, Venezuela. <laughs> that can, maybe it's a common last name. I don't know. Yeah, maybe. We'll have to do some more research later. If someone wants to do that research for us, or someone who knows for sure. Well, I don't know what the guys pulled earlier. Oh, supposedly Brian not related to Xander. Okay. Yeah, I feel like they would have said on the back of the yeah, baseball been card. Like a fun fact. Yeah. Biggest hit today. I pulled that plate auto. Yeah, I pulled a couple reds. I pulled a Cam Collier red auto. There. That's right. That's true. I think I think um, in the in the jumbo. I feel like the best. I feel like the best prospect going about so far was that uh, Brock Wilkin gold, and then I think oh, okay. I think uh, I want to say uh, Michael hit a orange Walker Jenkins. Okay, that's pretty cool. There's Luis Matos. Yeah, we're looking for we're some of those big colored for these guys in the top load, especially, right. of course, Dylan Cruz. I mean, that's he seems super hard to find. Oh, is that right? Patrick Beverly is being investigated by Indianapolis police after he threw a ball at that fan? Hmm. Yeah, yeah, I don't think he's ever going to See how rude he was to that reporter? Yeah. 
You know, subscribe. You know, subscribe to my podcast. Yeah, you're not gonna hear me. Yeah, yeah. Right. That's. Like two to one. You're not good enough to say stuff I know. like that. <laughs> you're not. You never have. You think you are Jamal Murray? Yeah. Jamal Murray can throw things out on the court and he can still play. He's Walker Jenkins. Yeah, imagine if Patrick Beverly. Yeah, Patrick. Out of the league. Like, see ya, Patrick. You're done for the playoffs. All right, Luis Baez, Chrome. And there's another box. There's a Jake Wilson paper to four ninety nine. There's a uh, Lazaro Montes Rising Infernos. That's kind of a cool. There it is. One forty nine out of one fifty mini diamonds. Chris Parent with the Mariners. Jacob Wilson's going to go to Brian H and the A's. Jason Dominguez. I told him, so what's the verdict at the post office? Kendrick or Drake? She's like, you know Drake is uh, fine as F, right? <laughs> I was like, so? I was that beard. And then she's like, what about this? And the Kendrick's like, she's lying, TJ. So. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, you got to back up the hometown guy. Yeah. Not some, well, that's not some, that not some, not some Canadian. Canadian. It's just more like, oh, he's so good looking, you know. Right, yeah, I mean. Then you get more fans that way, obviously. There's a, a prospect power up Lombard Jr. for the Yankees. And then we got Yoshinobu and Dylan Cruz paper. Dude, he's bounced around like six teams in the last like four years. Yeah, if it was anybody else, maybe I'd be like, I don't know, maybe the fan said something, but knowing Patrick Beverly's sort of history. But some guys play on the, it's like it's like Draymond. You, sometimes you, you have to play on that edge, and that's what makes Draymond good. I mean, like Patrick Bradley's not even close to Draymond. Like no, Draymond's Draymond. really good. Draymond's yeah. good, yeah. Draymond, but he's great. Yeah. 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 No, I seen the foul ball that Jordan got hit right in the kneecap yesterday. Ooh. Dude, he can't even walk for a Max little bit. Max Clark to one fifty. That number is kind of faded a little bit there. We can kind of see it. I like the new font. Right, does it look a the new weird? numbers? Yeah, the numbering, sorry. Yeah. yeah. Like, I get it's a little bit bigger, but... Yeah, I'm not sure if I'm thrilled with the numbering. But I like the design, though, yeah, the this year. Nice. It's I, me now. I kind of like that, you know, like, he seems like he's popping out of the border. Mm -hmm. Sort of like the depth in there. Yeah, apparently, Rex, that's been an issue. I think more catchers are getting... It's either the batters are standing deeper in the box, or the catchers are moving for, forward a little bit more, or maybe a little bit of both. But the guys are catchers are getting the end of the bat into their helmet a lot more often. It's Brock Wilkin. So there has been a slight little uptick in uh, like catchers in like concussion protocol. All right, we got some orange shimmer coming up. What do we got? It is Robert Kalaz, eight out of 25, orange shimmer for the Colorado Rockies. That's gonna go to Inku with the Rocks. Yeah, I know. I saw the injury report, he went down with a fractured arm, it's crazy. So I don't know, stuff like that keeps happening. They may they may have to kind of keep an eye on where, where catchers and hitters, how they're setting up. Yeah. 
Lombard Jr. paper, Brock Wilkin chrome, Oh, that was a Yoendri Morales. For the Nats, that's for Tristan. All right, what would hurt more, an 85 mile per hour fastball or a bat moving 85 miles per hour. Bat weighs more. There's a Mike Bo Eve, Bove, Ray Wave to 150. That's gonna be for Matt and the, uh, the Brew Crew and a mini diamond, not numbered, George Lombard Jr. Mark Bissett with the Yankees. Nice seeing parallels of some of these key players here that we're, that we're chasing. Tell you what, Rex, you come on over and we'll, uh, we'll find a pitching machine to uh, fire an 85 mile per hour baseball into your midsection. And then we'll find a, uh, a local. Uh, I'm sure Michael's got some decent swing speed. Well, yeah, we'll have we'll have Michael swing a baseball bat into your midsection. You tell us which hurt more. We'll we'll do it for uh, we'll do it for the content. What do you think, Rex? Ooh, and some. Oh, I thought that was red for a second. No, it's. Uh, Filippo de Turi, 142.99 paper, magenta paper. For Matt and the Brew Crew, there's Aiden Miller for the fight and fills. Lombard Jr. Walter Jenkins for the Twins. Aiden Miller, Prospect Power Up, Arjun Nimala for Toronto. You're surprised that what, pitchers don't get hit more by a ball? I mean, hitting a baseball is one of the hardest things to do in professional sports, I think, right? These guys are only hitting it successfully a third of the time they're out there, Rex. And how many of, how many of the time is that, uh, and then you gotta look at fly ball rate versus ground ball rate and line drive rates. And then you take that small amount of time these guys are making contact. Here's Justin Crawford to 299. And then how many of those are line drives? It's even less percentage. And then how many of them are straight at, you know, right up the middle? And that percentage goes down even more. I'll bet we can find that information. I'll bet if we did a little digging in, in fan graphs, we probably could see league, um, we could probably see what the league, as a league, as a whole, where they're hitting it. There's Eric Bautista, the green grass, parallel, 48 out of 99. It's another Rocky for Inku. William has seen plenty this year already. 
you know, the comebacker right at a pitcher. There's Arjun Namala. The most impressive play in baseball. The most impressive play. I mean, a lot of things are impressive in baseball. Pitcher catches a line drive back to them. Yeah, those, that is pretty cool. The the sort of instinctive <laughs> reflex that they have there. Sleep, sleep, sleep. What happened to this ump? I don't know. He's looking at his eyes. Oh shit! They're kind of like holding him up. Did he get hit by a bat? Slide some more boxes onto the table here. It's time to like sit down. Oh, you know what? Let's see. He was, he was doing this. He was like crouching. Maybe got hit right in the. Oh. Oh. Yes. He was crouching right now. Oh, oh, oh that got him. That yeah, got you know, him. If you, if you know, like when you're like that, the cup kind of moves up. Oh, so it's kind of exposed. Did it catch the, under? The bottom, yeah, I think I think you're exposed. right. Yeah, yeah, the bottom is exposed. Oh, oh yeah. no. Yeah, oh down boy, down right poor guy. <laughs> the the in the Diamondbacks Reds game. It's a national game. It's on the FS1. The ball skipped off the dirt through the five hole of the catcher oh. and bounced right up into the umpire in that in that Very spot. Yeah. yeah, and it, it would it would be like it's almost like the perfect angle yeah, where perfect. it would catch you right under the cup yeah. where it's not. Ooh. <laughs> that one they're probably holding him about to pass out, dude. Like he was probably like, "Whoa, dude!" I mean, he went down like a ton of bricks. It got him square right there. Oh, yeah. That's not just a reaction. That's no, yeah, that's just, that, <laughs> that's just. Hey. That would be on not Sports Center top yeah. 10. Yeah, not top 10. Walter Jenkins paper. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. Baseball is an interesting sport. I feel like in terms of fandom, if you didn't grow up with it, I feel like it's hard to introduce people who are like didn't watch baseball and now you try to get them to watch it. Um and it's kind of hard to convince people if you're if you've been watching football or basketball your entire life, and then you try to get them to do baseball. It's a little bit more difficult. But if you catch him when, you know, if you if you catch a a kid who, with with the baseball bug early on, is Gunnar Henderson to 150 for the O's, Jeff Gordon with that one, then I think it it holds a little bit more. You can appreciate baseball a lot more. Yeah, what do you what do you like, Brian, on the baseball field? Outfielders throwing someone out at home plate or stealing home from third. Yeah, the steal of home is always is always exciting. No, no Brewers, Matt. I'll do a recap at the end, so you'll you'll see you'll see everything when I'm done. I like, I kind of like, you know, if you want to think defense, like when when a when a outfielder is running away from the ball, the ball is going over him and he dives and catches it. That play, in terms of defense, is pretty amazing.
There's J.D. Gonzalez, purple at a 250. Nothing really too crazy yet, Matt. But we still have a lot of boxes to go. And we're seeing some solid players, but you know we're not really seeing any of the... We haven't seen autos of any of the top guys that we have on our list. Haven't seen any low numbered cards of any of those anything 25 or under haven't seen anything like that we did get that printing plate auto and then we got travis sakura for the nationals tristan with the nets we haven't seen dylan cruz autographs which is what tristan's looking for no apologies to Travis, but we, we have bigger fish to fry here. No, <laughs> oh, no, nothing about that. That last name. He's the honey man. Whoa. Ooh, Travis, honey man. He the honey man. Hey, we didn't get no crazy last names this time around. Yeah. Really some really good ones last year. Good ones last year. All right, another box. Luis Baez. Yeah, a big hit, another uh, another one of one, or out of five would be nice. Brock Wilkin paper. I feel like Brian called it last time, so I'm gonna believe him right now, something's gonna happen. Yeah, yeah, let's make something happen. Dylan Cruz, we're looking for his auto. Where are you? Or, or low numbered, orange to 25 out of five and under, something like that for Dylan Cruz. Got Ellie, we got Johan Rojas, who's been having a solid season. He's 399. Dylan Cruz, paper. Stack was getting a little high. Yamamoto, Teal. Marcelo Meyer to 299. Max Clark. Thomas is having a bit of an up and down season this year, Rex. Last year was pretty good throughout. I might try to I might actually try to see him him play on Friday. Ooh, red? Brian H Brian said big hit express time. Yeah, no. 184 out of 199, Homer Bush. I totally thought that was going to be an out of five. All right, 
Lombard Jr., Brock Wilkin, Chrome. Do I think Tops loads their jumbos up more to incentivize? Uh, no, I do not. That wasn't a Brewer, but this is Luke Adams. Autograph for Matt and the Brew Crew. Use the force, Luke. Della Cruz. All right, a couple more boxes and I'll slide the rest onto the table. We're almost there. Ladies and gentlemen, we are almost there. Wait, what wasn't Brewers? Yeah, the Homer Bush Jr. is a Padre. Here's Ellie Della Cruz, if that's what the card you were talking about. Yamamoto. CJ Abrams. Aiden Miller. Lombard Jr. Walker Jenkins for the Twins. And Purple Bandana, 186 out of 199. Cooper Pratt, Brew Crew. This one's a brewer. For Matt. Carson Rucker, 94 out of 150. Arjun Namala. Carson Rucker will go to Detroit. That will be for Joe Downing. Jackson Holiday. Sebastian Walcott, prospect power up. We've seen the White Sox Riku Nishida's autograph in Japanese, but some look a lot different than others. Interesting. No, I have not. Morales Emmanuel Tejada 18 out of 150 Blue Shimmer for the Yankees that's going to go to Mark B like Japan Samurai variation autograph. Really? Yeah, which I thought was quite good. 
What is it? What What does it look like? I have no idea. I think it's a redemption. Oh. I, th- I think he's also redemption. I don't know. Jared Serna for the Yankees. That's the autograph. That'll be for Mark. But besides his rookie autograph, he has one of those. That, is that the name of like Team Japan? Or is that... Oh, it, it is it was Team like Japan? Samurai? It said Japan I Samurai. guess so, yeah. I, mean, I don't know. Hmm. I didn't realize they actually had a mask. Like, cool. So what is like the United States? like? <laughs> What, like our mascot? Oh, yeah, like it was Japan, like Samurai. Oh, that's nice. nice, Corbin Carroll anime. I guess we would be the Mighty Eagle. <laughs> right? <laughs> Zankoa Nguyen with the Diamondbacks. I think these are pretty cool. One per case. Cool to collect a set of that. Who's the one in the first one? I think it was Marcelo Meyer for the uh, Yankee, or, uh, Red Sox. Ellie De La Cruz. All right, one more box and I'll put the rest on the main camera. Almost there. That is you. Thanks for getting in, that's the case hit. There's a Shue De Paula to 15. Nice low number there. For Ramon and the Dodges, Luis Baez. for Toronto. Kyle Teal paper. We got Roman Anthony paper to three ninety nine for the Red Sox. Walter Jenkins Chrome. Luis Baez Paper. George Lombard Jr. to one ninety nine. Looks like purple lunar. On that one, ten out of one ninety-nine. That's for Mark and the Yankees. Brock Wilkin paper. Cruz. 
And Walker Martin, 419 out of 499, is your refractor autograph. That's for Charles and the Giants. George Lombard Jr. Paper. Yeah, that could be the case for X. I just seen it right now. You know, maybe after X amount of the new signing, like, oh, I'm just gonna change my really quick. Yeah, Rex. Right? It's a, it's a written language. Everyone's gonna have sloppy versions and and the prob more proper versions. They're humans, just like us. All right, here are the final four boxes. Thanks, everyone. Yeah, right. I mean, it's just like just like learning the language. And, you know, your brains are at a younger age. It's much easier to capture different languages than it is to learn a new language when. Your main language is already set. All right, final four boxes. Good luck, everybody. Kyle Teal. Paper for the Red Sox. Uh, that, that's where stereotypes get you, Rex. <laughs> Ellie Dela Cruz, purple paper, 84 out of 250. You know, Rex, I know some Germans who are inefficient. <laughs> it happens. Arjun Nimala in that insert. I don't know what the name of that insert is, but it looks cool. James Wood, ooh, piece of candy. Oh, we got a nice Dylan Cruz, not auto coming up, but Parallel, which is something we like to see. So there's the Brock Wilkin paper and the Dylan Cruz. It's Aqua Shimmer. Nice. 121 out of 125. Nice. That's going to be for Tristan and the Nationals. Will we find some ink? There's Dylan Cruz Chrome. Ellie Dela Cruz. Yamamoto. Dylan Cruz Paper. And Samad Taylor, 151 out of 499. Refractor autograph for the Royals. That's going to be for Brian H.
from Corona. Wow, that's cool. About an hour or so east of here. There's Matt Schott, 250, purple Ray Wave. Cubs, EA with the Cubbies. 215 there? Yeah. Near the, uh, near the speedways around there. Luis Baez. All right, three boxes to go. Three boxes, three more autos to go. Hopefully find some more low numbered parallels. There's Mini Diamond, Robert Collaz, not numbered. Walter Jenkins. <laughs> yeah, we know that, Rex. Luis Baez. Got a Luke Adams. Use the force. 252 out of 299. Use the force, Luke. Arjun Namala Chrome. And nice. James Wood in that spotlight design, which is a, a lot a lot shorter printed this year. We'll go to Tristan and the Nationals. Dylan Cruz, Rising Infernos, got an Ellie Della Cruz paper. Ethan Salas. Daniel Susak, 486 out of 499, Refractor for the A's, that'll be for, uh, for Brian. Aiden Miller for the Phillies, for Rich. Yamamoto for the Dodgers, the, uh, Ramon, I think, yeah. Found all the guys now? I think so, yeah. I think so, yeah, 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 we did. And we got a George Wolkow, 91 out of 150. Ooh. Jason with the White Sox. Jumbo number four, guys, is down to three. Nice. I can do that right now. Let's put it on the board. And it's also 20% off the remaining teams. Wow. Reds, Angels, and A's, the last three teams.
add Ellie. All right, two boxes to go. Almost there, stay on target. Cards on the bottom here. That's Yo Endry Morales. There's Wolkow again. There's Arjun. Walter Jenkins prospect power up. Uh, Walker Jenkins. Did I say Walter before? Walker. There's Cooper Pratt, 002 to 399, paper for the Brew Crew. George Lombard Jr. for the Yankees. Later. George Lombard Jr. prospect power up. Ali De La Cruz, Aiden Miller, Infernos, Aiden Miller paper. Yamamoto, uh, Maui Ahuna, 97 out of 150, Ray Wave for the Giants, that'll be for Charles. Sure, I can take over for like the next maybe close to an hour. Okay. You can take a lunch break if you want. Yeah. It's up to you. I'm here till seven. So. And if that bonus sells, I can do it while you're eating. And then. That sounds good. I'll, I'll probably snack in between. Yeah. And Capri Ortiz is your auto for John and the Halos. Three. Not two. Three. And then two in the jumbo, she said, so I'm gonna pronounce it. Gladiators of the Diamond, Pete Crow Armstrong. Like those are not too common either. All right, final box, 24th box, 24th hobby box. We did it. We made it, folks. We did it. Thank you. Just right at the two-hour mark, about what we predicted. Close to it. Let's finish strong. What are we going to find in our 24th box? A Super Fractor, maybe? An auto of one of the, the big-time names, the top-tier prospects that we're looking for? Good luck, everybody. Thank you for getting in. I appreciate you.
10th anniversary, ladies and gentlemen. 10 years of this stuff we've been doing. Here's a Spencer Jones Origin of Greatness to 10. Nice. That's a cool looking uh, insert here. Can you see that one? I think that's the short printed ones too. Oh, wait, no, I don't see that one. Oh, I don't know. Actually, I don't know. Pretty cool, right? No, I don't think I've seen that one. Yankees, that's going to be for Mark. Brock Wilkin paper. That ball go off his face after the outfielder? I didn't see it. It got, almost looked like it did. Like he didn't catch it, or just it? It was weird. I only saw it in the corner of my eye. Oh, oh, maybe off the shoulder. shoulder yeah. Chest, yeah. He was sliding for it. The ball dropped in front of him, and then it bounced up and hit his chest. That could have been bad. <laughs> Caught him in the mouth. Something. See you later, half. Later. Oh, it was already that time? <laughs> it's six o'clock Dang, time flies by when you're doing Bowman. Right. Ali De La Cruz. Oh shoot, that means there's basketball on too. Yeah, the Knicks are on right now. <laughs> They're like half time, I think. Oh man. It just was in a, was in a Bowman hole. <laughs> you know, like the K hole, but like a Bowman hole and you're just like, Deep it? in oh, it. <laughs> what, what, what day is it? Just blink and it'll just be like. No, oh, like it's pretty so long, but then you realize, wow, two hours passed. Like, yeah, crazy. just like that. Dylan Cruz Chrome. All right, the auto should be on this side. Fingers crossed, and good luck, everybody. Thanks again for the fill. We've got jumbo. We don't have any more hobbies, but we've got jumbos left, which are, which are a little bit faster, especially with, with two people. So maybe we can get a break or two of that done before Jason goes, and let's see what else we can get into to the rest of the night. I know it's been a long day, but maybe we can finish this day strong. 10th anniversary day. Thanks everyone who supported us over the last 10 years. Obviously could not do it without you. Oh, do the Reds want to win me some money here? There's Arjun. Let's go, walk it off. We got a Zavala power up. Lombard. I feel like we should be seeing the auto soon. Lombard prospect power up. Yamamoto. Oh, these are as well. Some of these Everson are Pereira orange. Short, short print oh, those are short print too. Okay, that's, I'm glad I pulled that. Those are nice. That went to EA and the Cubs. That. PCA, Gladiators card. We got Rising Infernos, Jackson Churio. Matt Shaw, Prospect Power Up. We got Jaron Elkins to 399. Lava. Luke Keyshaw. Wait, is there no auto in here? Or was it the Capri Ortiz? Here's the recap. There's the Corbin Carroll. That's a cool design.
There's the other one from the first case. There's the plate, that was really cool. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. We got short and auto in that last box. That was disappointing. I really have. I don't think I missed it. I feel like someone would have said something if I missed it. Yeah. Sorry, guys. It does happen. Mm, yeah, I guess we got short and auto. That sucks. It happens. Not too often, but it, I've seen that happen before. Give me a hat, Jason. Cool. We're gonna randomize, I know it's not the same, but we'll randomize a Jaspi hat, brand new hat to somebody. It's at least like a $40 hat, bro. I mean, it's like a $1,000 hat. I mean, it's like a $5,000 hat. It's yeah. All right, so let's gather everybody's names here. And let's roll it, randomize it, name on top. We'll get a Jaspi hat. Three and a two, five times. One, two, three, four, and five. And it's gonna be Ramon. There you go, Ramon, who had the Dodgers. Get a get a slick Jaspi hat going your way. Look at that. Cool new logo. There's the back on it. Kind of a kind of some good summer vibes in this hat, I think. So there you go, gang. Doubleheader three in the books. I'm Joe. Uh, thanks for 10 years of Jaspies. We appreciate all of you. Here's to 10 more. We'll see you next time for the next one. Jaspiescasebreaks.com.